Okay, hello my darlings, it's Michaela. So I just wanted to share um, some things that have been really helpful for me to not drink easily. Um, in the beginning of November, I made a decision that I wanted to drink significantly less. And so I have deliberately drank on a few holidays, my birthday in March, um, and kind of not really otherwise. Um, and so I just thought to share some of the things that have made not drinking really easy and really obvious. Um, so I think about the fact that alcohol is poison. Um, I think about the fact that it's so negative for our health, um, that it can predispose a body to like seven plus types of cancer. I think about the fact that it puts fat metabolism on hold, that it's empty calories, that um, when I typically have alcohol over the course of an evening, my blood sugar will drop, as well as my inhibitions, making me want to eat more at the end of the night and typically like garbage food, um, and then feeling regret or anxiety about how that impacts my waistline. Um, I think about the fact that you know, it kind of ruins my next day. Um, even with a small amount of alcohol, I feel like it can impact um, how clear I am, my sleep, um, what time I wake up, um, what else is really greatly impacted, um, how clearly I can think, how creative I can be. Um, I also think about the fact that, you know, I kind of miss the connections that could be in an event, at an event, in an experience. Um, and that's really something that I want. Um, also, <laughs> alcohol speeds aging. And that's like the last thing that I want to have happen. I do so many things to help slow aging, to resist aging. And so that just seems like dumb. Anyway, and that's how I view drinking now, that it's like actually kind of dumb. It can be fun. And so like do it, you know, when you really want it, but don't have it be your typical pastime. Don't have it be, these are the words I say to myself, like I don't want this to be expected. I don't want it to be automatic. I don't want it to be necessary to have fun. And the truth is it's not. Um, I think about the fact that like, Basically, with alcohol in our system, we can only get so high. It's like fast, fun, and then there's a cap on it. And so it's like, I know that like the level of joy that I can actually experience without alcohol in my system is so much higher. And like, as goofy as it might sound, like I literally want to be like high on life um, and not on a substance. A practice that I did that I was guided into um, basically helped me to get disenchanted with alcohol. Um, and so I would encourage anyone to do this. It's so useful. Basically writing down, making two lists, like the pros and the cons of alcohol. So I made a big fat list of pros. Like there were like lots of things that were like sexy and fun about alcohol and basically rated that from one to 10. And then I made a list of cons, all the shit that like is regrettable, that doesn't feel good, that like doesn't treat me well, um, doesn't impact my life in a positive way, that makes me feel like, you know, shameful, not proud. Um, made a big fat list of that, rated it one through 10 as well. And that list was so much longer. And the truth is I looked at that enough times to kind of have it stay in my brain. And so whenever there's the question of like, you know, Michaela, what are you drinking? Or would you like a drink? It's like, I don't want all that shit. And the biggest thing that I think is actually really helpful is like, I don't want to let myself down. And so now that like really matters. That like is a factor in my decision-making process, which is like a brag as well. I will just say that. Um, anyway, so that might be useful for anyone watching this. Um, I think that alcohol is automatic, um, for so many people in so many situations, which in my opinion is really ridiculous. Like it is literally poison. Um, it is a mind altering substance. Um, and again, it's like, uh, it just... It seems benign, it's so commonplace, 
um, but it's really like shitty for us. And I will say this as someone that like, you know, has heartily enjoyed alcohol, um, but who really doesn't want to have it be like much in my life at all. And anyway, these have been some really useful things. All right, hope that was great. Please be in touch for any reason. Thank you for being here and um, until next time.